every year, um, Coach Kakura, I can call him Coach because he was uh, one of my coaches when I was at Kirtland. He was there for five, five years when I was there as head football coach. And um, I was fortunate enough to also be in Kirtland for a year with Coach Tiger Liberty too. What those guys don't know is that um, as superintendent high school principal, I used to pretend I was the team owner. And nobody else knew that. But we, uh, we could hang out at practices and talk to the basketball coach on the bench before a game, go up the field and talk to the football coach. And, and uh, I, I want to thank both Dan and Tiger. Neither one of them ever mentioned to me that I really wasn't the team owner. They, they just let me think that. Um, yeah, every year, uh, Coach Kikuri gives us the applications, the information, the letters of recommendation for the committee to determine who will be the winner of the Chuck Kelby Award for that particular year. And it's really information about 11 special students and athletes. And then we have to pick one. It's not an easy job, but, but uh, we do it. And I think uh, a, a perfect example of the quality of, of the information that we get and the people that that information represented is, uh, represents is verified by George and, and what, what he has done with his life and what he talked to you about just a minute ago. Uh, I think the best way to uh, give the results of this is to, I just highlighted some phrases and and uh, words from, from the letters of recommendation and the uh, application material uh, that we received from, from the candidates. And I'm just going to just recite some of those phrases. Incredibly responsible and conscientious. Assignments in school always completed thoroughly, carefully, and on time. All academic, all conference athletic award highest GPA on the football team, well-liked, uh, respected by his peers and the adults that know him, sense of humor, friendliness, friendliness, interested in studying engineering or forensic science, mature and dependable, makes commitments and then honors them. Lacrosse, captain of the lacrosse team, Recreation League baseball for nine years, Recreation League basketball for three years, principals list every year since sixth grade, recipient of a 2018 award that deals with attitudes that are visible at school, involvement with nonprofit organizations, member of the Altar Server Society, helped with the Cleveland Food Bank every month for five years. Football for four years, lacrosse for three years, National Honor Society as a junior and senior, Conference Scholar Athlete Award recipient each year, News Herald Best in Classroom Award winner, August 2018, number three out of the class of 344, and it's taken nine advanced placement classes throughout high school. So I'm Honored and pleased to present the 2018 Student Athlete Award, the Chuck Kelby Award, to Colin Christopher from East Lake North. Colin's going to say a few words. Um, first off, I'd like to thank my mom and my dad. They pushed me every day to give everything I had in the classroom and on the football field. Um, I'd actually like to thank the committee for, uh, for selecting me to win this award. 
I'd actually like to thank my coaches, especially Coach Dodd over there. He, uh, he was on my butt. He got me to morning workouts every day, got me committed, got me grinding every day, both for football and in the classroom. And uh, last, I'd like to thank everybody that I've played with uh, for all 12 years that I've played the game of football. Everybody that I've played against, too. You've all made me the man I am today, and I have to thank you all.